Okay, I'm a little late to this, but a few weeks ago there was a hotfix to the Bloodline, which changed the way that the Pyro Staff Flintlock build operates just a little bit. Very, very small situation. Uh, the Staff ability, the Staff Totem, has been buffed. And so in the past, you used to just leave your Staff in the ground, and then the Staff Totem would deal terrible damage. Horrible damage. I was like, why would I sacrifice my staff's unique ability, all the staff abilities, the now the the just regular cool move set that you can use now? Uh, why would I sacrifice that and the, the increased mana regen that it brings for quite frankly awful damage? And you wouldn't. And so they buffed it so that you keep your staff. So let's show you this. I have a Caplox number three, and I keep the staff. And look, the damage is. Awful, awful, awful damage. You see pyro ability there. We're gonna use staff ability here. Yeah. Like that, the, the damage there, you know, it's just awful, like 15 damage per. Here, let's do this again. Caps lock three. 15 damage. Okay, we'll use thunder staff now. Yeah, 250 damage. Detonation. Yeah, we're pretty set there, you know? We're pretty good on staff abilities. We're pretty good on all my other abilities. So why do I have it there? Why is it good? Here's the thing. The way that I use it out in the open is is terrible. It's awful. But you see how just how far the staff projectile travels when it's in totem. That is what's good. The speed... The tracking, the aggro, that's huge. That's going to give you knowledge. It's going to let you know that there's enemies nearby. So if you're in uh, somewhere neat where there's going to be mining or looting from chests or whatever containers, when you're in that scenario, when you're inside a building or something, you can just go, okay, I'm just going to set this down. Especially if your summons or what have you is on cooldown. You're just going to set it down and forget it. And then you're going to get to mining. You're going to get to doing your looting. And if this thing fires off, you know that there's an enemy nearby. And you need, to, you need to stay vigilant. You need to get ready. But, yeah. It's really good for that. That's why I have it on the caps lock. Just because it's very situational. Still nice. And, again, not too much cooldown when it goes away. So, really usable. Really great. Alright. Thank you so much for watching. That's it for today. And I'll see you guys some other time. Bye.